Join now with you and I, Associate Athletic Director Nathan Christensen, talking Panther athletics as the winter sports are coming down the home stretch here, getting close to their conference championships. Uh, Nathan, uh, a lot of buzz around that men's basketball team going over the 20 win plateau once again this season. Just a fantastic, special season this year for men's basketball. Yeah, it's been certainly exciting for. Uh our student athletes, our staff members, and then obviously the community members and getting a chance to really see this special team and, you know, selling out the Drake game that just shows what type of support this team's getting this year. And, you know, two remaining games left um, against uh, Southern Illinois and then um, our last home game against Evansville. So we're really excited about the season, how it's going, um, and hopefully come out and support this team. Such an atmosphere uh, when the Panthers hosted Drake. You mentioned that sellout. And those two home games, man, that's the last opportunity to go see this team and see what they're made of this year. Absolutely. And hopefully we're going to clinch a conference uh, regular season championship. So, uh, yeah, come out and support all these guys. Tickets start as low as $10. Uh, but a very special team with, uh, you know, great leaders from seniors, from Spencer Haldeman and Isaiah. Um, and just from top to bottom, these guys are great student athletes. Uh, great teammates and just good people. That first weekend in March the 6th through the 8th, the Missouri Valley Conference Tournament. Uh, love to have a lot of Panther fans down there as the Panthers, you mentioned, likely to wrap up that regular season title. Potential one seed for your UNI Panthers. Get down there and make a home court advantage. Absolutely. We sold out of our allotment, so there's a lot of uh, Panther nation, m nations making its way down to St. Louis, but tickets are still available through the Enterprise Center, so feel free to reach out to them. But yeah, we're, there'll be a lot of Panther fans down there in St. Louis. We've got A.J. Green, potential player player of the year for the Valley. Uh, five special seniors this year, Isaiah Brown, Spencer Haldeman, uh, Justin Dahl, you have Luke McDonald and uh, Lincoln Connery. Those those five guys have a senior day coming up. Uh, it'll be a, a special send off for them. Yeah, so we're going to host that against Southern Illinois after the game, do a little send off for them, uh, but then we'll come back uh, next Wednesday against Evansville for their last um, home game. But we wanted to make sure we could have senior day on a weekend to get their families and friends and easier for them to uh, partake. The women's basketball team also at home. They've got a home game coming up uh, on Saturday, and then in March they'll host the Drake Bulldogs, a highly anticipated basketball game. They're in the top half of the Valley standings as well and trying to get some momentum as they go towards uh, the conference tournament that's held down in the Quad Cities. Yeah, and this, the league this year is really tough for the women's basketball. You know, MVC, they have, you know, four or five great teams, um, and it's they've had a great year so far, you know, beating Iowa, Iowa State, and Missouri, and, you know, these next few home games here um, going to be a big test for them to make a good run and get down to uh, hoops in the heartland. Um, so come on and support them as well. All right, it's the teams that are number two and number three in the Valley standings that are still yet to come to Cedar Falls. So go to UNIPanthers.com, get your tickets today. We'll have more with Nathan Christensen coming up. We'll be talking wrestling, and we'll be talking a lot more around uh, Panther athletics as well. Stay tuned to Panther Sports Talk.